Good afternoon, everyone. So, this video, I'm giving you just a couple updates. I'm going to mow my, mow my client across the street tomorrow for the first time this year. If the snow, if all the snow melts away. Because yes, yesterday we got a massive snowfall in the morning. Oh, by the way, today is... Today is March 26th, 2018. It's been forever since I've made a video. So... So, yeah. Yeah, all this... Still got a little bit of snow. Got a little bit of snow. A little bit of snow. My dad's 2006 Trailblazer. Still got some snow on our front lawn. A little bit on our back lawn too. It's kind of muddy right here. I'm gonna go back inside. So I am filming. I'm filming with my new tablet right now because my old tablet's out of battery. I got this thing for Christmas last year. So, equipment I'm thinking of taking, by the way, here's our massive bike collection, including mine over there. I think I think later this week I'm gonna do another bike ride with Tom video. So, what I'm thinking of taking with me, I, I texted my dad the the model and serial number of of my two other mowers that I want to get fixed. Like this the Craftsman and my Cub Cadet which is on the other side of the yard, but I'm thinking of taking my X Mark. This is this is remember that mower number six I had last year? This is number 10, so this is a different one. I think this one is newer. I think this one is newer than number 6. This gas tank isn't the same. And... My dad had, like last summer, my dad had some old trimmer trap racks from an old lawn mowing trailer from ProCare. And he gave them to me so I can hang my weed eaters. I'm thinking of taking this thing. I'm gonna take. I'm gonna take the still FS94R. FS94. It's a good trimmer. Great trimmer, actually. <coughs> So you wouldn't you wouldn't see me using the 94 very often because my dad keeps it in his work truck during the mowing season because he has to go help somebody. But still got my FS 100 RX. I'm gonna be getting another 100 RX this year to keep as a backup on my rack. Maybe even a second blower so I don't have to use. My BG56 all the time. That thing's been used a lot lately. Gas cans. I got a four cycle gas can, two cycle. Got a tool tool crate or tool drawer, whatever you want to call it. Yeah. So. We have some we have some more equipment back here. Right here is my old Husqvarna 223L. Let's see, 223L, which I don't use anymore because either gonna do something about it or get rid of it. I mean, it's been a good trimmer for a little bit, but it's starting to break down a lot. This tiller is not working very well either. I put a new primer in it last year and it didn't do anything. 
But we've still got my hedge trimmer. I mean, my dad's hedge trimmer. Oh, hold on, let me get these chaps off of the rack first. Oh, let's get this thing off. a little rust bubble on that on that thing. So this is my dad's steel HS81T. It's got some webs on it. Got a spider web on it. <laughs> That's funny. My dad once had an HS82R, I believe that's what that's what he had. 82R I'm thinking thinking. Yeah, yeah, it was 82R. If you're wondering what this thing is, this does look my look like my other tube for the BG56, but that was the other tube piece for my my old Echo PB251 leaf blower, which I don't have anymore. I threw it away because it just it just stopped running like it didn't start anymore my cord came undone a lot of times and yeah that just really freaking sucks it was a good blower though here's our backyard we've still, still got a little bit of snow back here I accidentally left my Lego plow truck out here. Big off-roader. Oh. An outdoor dining set. There's, there's a Cub Cadet right here. Yeah. Just wanted to give you a couple, just a little update, not a couple. Yeah, we still got a tiny bit of snow. <sighs> Next how this Halloween. This Halloween it's October of this this year. When we do our when we put up our decorations, I'm gonna film a video and tour around tour around my yard the decorations all this thing well this lawnmower runs it runs pretty good but all it needs is a new starter rope that starter ropes not not gonna be very good anymore my dad's still working on the waterfall project so here's our sauna Turn on the lights, you can probably see got a heater in there. A heater. Yeah, this door this door doesn't close. <sighs> this that door that door that door won't close. I think maybe t tomorrow or later or later t today I'm gonna do a lawn equipment startup video. I'll start my two trimmers, maybe this hedge trimmer, here. my X mark, my blower, here. and I've got a couple chainsaws, got a few chainsaws here. This Husqvarna 141. This is a saw my dad used to use all the time, but it's not working very. It doesn't work very well. And we have this Husqvarna 55 Rancher. This was 
This used to be my grandpa's saw before he passed away. Passed away like a week and a half ago. No, no, he had this saw. He had this saw before that, way before that. Like three, like three or five years ago. My grandma had this saw. This is my grandma on my dad's side of the family. So, my grandma had the saw. Mm -hmm. Would would use it for, it or keep it in, keep it in her shed. I mean, keep it in grandpa's sheds. But she didn't need it anymore because, because they were getting older and weren't able to do so much. But this is a pretty, it's pretty good, pretty good sized saw. I haven't seen my dad use this thing in years, but, so, there's a bag for my craftsman, I'll probably put it on, look at this, look at this gas can, look, look at this little thing I found, it's a no spill, it's a no spill can, I like these ones. This thing is frozen, or it's built fat like that on purpose. So, metal pile, all this kind of fancy stuff. Well, not really fancy things, but yeah. Hmm, got my two trimmers. They're both running really well. They were la They were both last running. They were both last running, um, I think last Saturday. Yeah, they were both running on Saturday. So, I'm going to end this video before it turns out too long. But, she's got a bunch of gas cans. I might just, might ask Dad to take them in. To, t to take them. Trimmer trap rack works pretty well. It at least keeps my trimmers secure and hung. Yeah, so. We got my dad's bicycle, bombs, my mom's road bike. My brother's older bicycle. This, that's his right now. So, I'm going to end the video now. And just to conclude, I might film tomorrow's lawn cutting at my client's place. And I'll, and I'll keep, I'll keep doing my old tradition, trimmer line as a tripod. <laughs> yeah. I'll keep doing that old tradition if I can find another spool. Cause, Cause I don't wanna take I don't wanna take that one down now. So hope you guys enjoyed the video and stay tuned for tomorrow's filming. Adios.